But for now, Harmony Vance comes to cheaters with suspicions concerning her boyfriend's anger issues. Desperately needing answers to her queries, Harmony begs for help. There are times where we may get into it or it may be something small as I wanted a piece of gum and he didn't give it to me to where he would get so mad to where he wouldn't speak with me for a weekend, for a whole weekend. And at first, I didn't think anything of it. But after so long, I'm, I, it just started getting suspicious where it would seem Thursday, we're okay, and then come Friday, there's some reason to be mad, and then you go the whole weekend without speaking to me. So we go to, to the same church on Sundays. So Sundays, it's usually, you know, Sunday morning, I don't hear anything. Sunday, get to church, I'm there, I don't say anything. And then midway through service, I may get a message saying I look nice or, hey, how was my weekend? And he comes back and he, and he just starts talking to me like nothing happened, like we didn't just not talk the whole weekend. Jay Talley, age 24, a website moderator accused of modifying his relationship by uploading with another woman. Cheaters headquarters dispatches a unit to follow the suspect from his residence. Tally arrives at an apartment complex and enters one of the buildings. Tally emerges from the apartment with a young, unknown female. The two get into the suspect's car. I questioned him about a, a name in a text message that I've seen. I, there's recently, I've seen the name Anthony pop up, and I know generally all of the people that he associates with. And Anthony is all through the call logs, all through mex messages. I haven't actually seen the messages, but there's this new name, Anthony. So when I questioned him about the name Anthony, he immediately, you know, made it into a big deal. We didn't speak, so it's really hard. I most of the time try to find my friends, see what they're doing to, to find things to do to keep myself occupied so I'm not thinking about it because literally I sit at home if I don't have anything to do and I'm, and I'm going through my head you know, trying to figure out what went wrong. What did I do? The Cheaters Mobile Unit follows Tally and his charge across town. The suspect stops at a convenience store to fill up his tank. The pair then get back on the road, covertly tailed by the cheater's team. Tally drives to a supermarket. He pulls up in front of the store and lets his paramour out. The young lady leans into the driver's side of the window to give Tally a kiss. After a moment, the suspect hits the road. If my suspicions are true, six years. It's just time that has been wasted for him, for myself. If he wanted to be with somebody, he could have just let me know. So if my, if my suspicions are, are true, I, I mean, I feel, I feel sorry for him. I will probably lose it. And, and when I say I, I'm going to lose it, I will probably do something I'm going to regret later. Cheater's operatives stake out Tally's residence. Tally comes out, hops into his car, and takes a short drive to the same super center he visited the day before. However, this time, the suspect picks up the woman he dropped off earlier. The woman, now identified as Ashley Simon, gets into his vehicle. The suspect and his date head down the road to a nearby roller rink. The pair enter the rink, don skates, and roll around the rink. After some time, the rolling couple remove the wheels from their feet. Tally and his skater girl go back to his car. The suspect then drives the young lady home. Carrying Simon's bag, Tally joins her inside. A while later, the suspect leaves the companion's residence and returns home for the night. As with previous days, Cheater's agents continue with the stakeout of Tally's residence. Sometime during the day, cheater spotters mark their target leaving his residence. Tally drives the now familiar route to his favorite shopping center. The suspect pulls into the lot and waits a few minutes. Simon shortly emerges from the building. The young lady climbs into the suspect's car and the two drive away. Unaware of the cheater's team on their tail, the pair arrive at a bar and grill. It appears as though the two of them have some sort of disagreement with Tally gesticulating derisively. However, once at their table, Simon seems to make up with her man. The suspect receives a kiss from his date. Sometime later, Tally and Simon leave the restaurant. A friendly tap on the behind signifies Tally's affection for Simon. Cheaters agents follow the suspect's car back to the supercenter. 
Then Tally drops Simon off. And as the suspect leaves, Cheater's agents prepare to collate all evidence for Harmony. Coming up, the confrontation. Thanks for watching Cheaters, Detective Gomez here. You know, there's nothing worse than catching somebody cheating. So I want you to visit DetectiveGomez.com and take my free cheating quiz. I've also written a book called Play to Win that helps you through a cheating situation. And of course, you can also watch my web series called Detective Gomez Private Eye. So visit DetectiveGomez.com today and remember, don't cheat. Having documented all deceitful actions of the suspect, Cheaters calls on Harmony to unveil the evidence. Abound with questions, Harmony comes forth to receive her answers. Well, as you know, Harmony, we have conducted our investigation. And my question for you is, are you prepared to see what we have come up with? I think so. Okay. On this day of our investigation, Harmony, we are outside of Jay's residence. A few moments later, Jay emerges, he walks over to his car, and he gets inside. As our detectives follow Jay, he drives some distance and he arrives at a supermarket. A short time later, that female walks out, gets into the vehicle, and leaves with Jay. As our detectives follow the two of them, they arrive at a roller skating rink. They go inside together. Internal surveillance shows the two of them skating, enjoying each other. After they take their skates off, Jay puts his shoes on, fixes his hat, and they walk out to the vehicle. That's when we see the two of them get inside, and they arrive at this unknown residence. We see the female get out. He hands Jay her backpack. He carries it for her. And a while later, he emerges from the apartment on his cell phone. He gets into his vehicle, and he leaves. Everything that, that you're showing me is just, he has to have been doing this for some time. OK, well, continuing on, Harmony, on this day of our investigation, we are outside of Jay's residence. A short time later, Jay nonchalantly strolls out of his house, walks over to his vehicle, and he gets inside. As our detectives follow Jay, he drives for some distance, and once again, he arrives at that supercenter from the previous day. We see that female, she walks over to the passenger side, and she gets into the vehicle. They leave the supercenter parking lot. As our detectives follow, they arrive at a bar. That's when we see them park the vehicle, they both get out, and they walk inside together. That's when we see the two of them conversing back and forth. They sit out on the patio, and Jay is drinking a beer, and that's when they lean in for a kiss. In Harmony, during this time, he gets a phone call. He steps away from the table. What you're about to hear is the audio from that. Tell me if you can remember this day. Hello? Hey, what you doing? Um, right now I'm at the studio at the moment. How long are you going to be there? Probably about another hour or so. I was just trying to make sure that we're still on for this evening. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not really for sure because I'm supposed to see my mom today, so. Hey. But if I have time, I, I, I will definitely let you know. I'll come shoot you a text. You can't cancel on me like you did Come on now. Time. Come on now. I'm, I'm working. I'm working. Okay, we're just going to try my best. Okay, call me when you get through. All right. Bye. Bye. Finishing up the phone call with you after lying to you, saying he was at the studio, he walks back outside, closes out his tab, and him and that female walk out together holding hands. Before they walk over to Jay's vehicle, he slaps her on her lower behind, and they leave. As our detectives follow, he returns her to the same super center where he picked her up. Jay then returns home for the evening. Harmony, you know what you've seen. My question is, are you ready to confront Jay? I'm ready. All right, listen. They are at a snow cone shop. He picked her up from the super center. They went there. If we get in the vans right now, we can go confront them. Yes, let's go. All right, right this way, please. So, Harmony, how are you feeling right now after seeing all that? I'm just in, in shock. I, I mean, I, I knew something was going on, but to actually see it, how I found out is, I don't know what to say. I'm speechless. We're here. This is the spot right here. We're here. Everyone out. Right there, the sunglasses on, right there. What the Wait, who are you? Don't touch me. What is she Don't doing here? Me. Why why is she here with you? That's my girl. Yeah. Okay. You, oh, this Come is on, your girl? Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Oh, this is like, your girl? Go. 
Don't touch me. Look at me when I'm talking to you. This is your girl? This is your girl? This is your girl? You tripping. You tripping. Don't be. Right now, right now. Chill, 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 chill. You don't even know me. You don't even know me. Chill, 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 chill. Let's go over here. Chill. No, no let me go. Let me yeah, go. Come on, let's go. What? What? Ain't nobody scared of you? What? Ashley, chill. Come, come on. on. Go over there, chill. Come on. Jay. I have a question, man. Can really, I talk to you Jay? for a second? Really, Jay? Six Why are you years? worried about it? Go on. Six years? Because it's my job. That's Six why I'm worried years, about it. Six years, Jay? Six years? And this is how it's going to end? Two for some hoe? She look like she's 15. No. No. She, she, she look like she's 15 years old. Coming up next, the conclusion. Thanks for watching Cheaters. Detective Gomez here. You know, there's nothing worse than catching somebody cheating. So I want you to visit DetectiveGomez.com and take my free cheating quiz. I've also written a book called Play to Win that helps you through a cheating situation. And of course, you can also watch my web series called Detective Gomez Private Eye. So visit DetectiveGomez.com today and remember, don't cheat. I throw the sunglasses on. What the f is going on? This is my girl. Yeah. She looks like she's 15 years old. She looks like she's 15 years old. Jake, I talk to you for a minute? Chill, chill, chill. Ashley, chill. Chill, Ashley, chill. Pretty good, man. Chill, man. So your name's Ashley? Yes, Ashley, who are you? Ashley, I'm Clark Gable with okay. Cheaters. I apologize, I don't know I'm not who here you are. to offend you. I'm just here to ask you a couple questions. I understand, but did you're you know, ruining things. Did you know that this man had a girlfriend for six years? No. She's a hoe, so she wouldn't know. She don't oh, care. Okay, but That's the kind of stuff she, she do. You, obviously, That's the kind of stuff she doing. Whatever, whatever, you're mad. But don't he be never, mad at me. But he, he never told you that? No. Never at all? No. Because she's not relevant. She's not important. No, I'm relevant. She's a side chick. But he's sleeping with me, though. You're mad. You're mad because he's sleeping with me. Don't touch him. Ashley, did you guys go? Is this you guys? Yeah, that's me. What's your point? My point is, why, if you had no idea this guy had a girlfriend and you just found this out, why would you still want to even Because I him? love him and I'm pregnant with his child, that's why. You're pregnant with his yes, child? Yes, I'm pregnant. I'm two months. What's your point? Uh, She's three. pregnant. Uh, two three. months pregnant? Jay, six and six years? Uh, three. And this is the kind of that you do to me? Uh, three. You can say Really? Uh, Are you serious? Uh, Are you serious, right? Chill, let me chill. Hey, Jay. Jay, come over Whatever, here. Whatever, I'm the side here. chick, but you don't have no here. baby. Stay in the side chick's position. Okay, okay. Obviously, you're the side chick. You had to hire them. Six years. You're the side chick. Jay, what happened, man? What Why, you did mean, you what you mean, man? Why did you do this? Like, how come you wouldn't tell her that you have a significant other? Come on, let's go. Or tell like, her this is awesome. that no, you have a girlfriend? No, let's go. You're not, you're not important. Why don't you touch me? You're not don't important. Don't touch me. I don't care if you're pregnant or not. Don't touch me. You will lose that baby today. Okay, pregnant or not. I will still beat your ass. Well, do you guys know about this? Do you remember taking a roller skating? I got you guys, you know, picking you up at work. Is that where you work? Hey, you yeah. spy on me? Well, she hired us, man, because you wouldn't tell because her Because you're truth. a liar. You're a liar. You're caught. I'm not, I'm not lying. I love, I love, I love, I want both of y'all. Come on. You're a liar. I'm you want lying. what? I want both. You want both? I want, I want both. But this is you the dude both? that you want to be with. You want both? I want both. Are you serious? This is the dude that you want to be with. This is the dude that you want to be with. You want two? You want two girls? That's Jenny? the best way. That's the best Jenny? way. Jay, I gotta ask you a Jay, question, I'm gonna man. do you a favor. You can keep that hoe. You can keep her. You can keep her. I want both. I want both. Jay. No. You lost the opportunity. You, know, you, know you can you. keep her. We got, we got chemistry. Six years. You, know you wasted what? my time. Got chemistry. Six what? years, Jay. You know, got no, it's no both. It's no both. It's one or the other. I'm gonna make it easier for you. You can Get keep the better chick. You guys can have each other. No, 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 no. No, it's not gonna, it's not gonna happen. You like can that. keep her. I have a question for you, Ashley. Do you recall having a lunch with him and having him step out for a minute for a phone call? Yeah, he does well, that often. He was on the phone with her that day. Thank you. Hung up the phone, said I loved you, said he was at the studio, completely lying to her Are you serious? and lying to you. Absolutely, I could show you it if you'd like to see it. It's but not even that because he does that all the time. He does and it all the time. I just thought it was business. So when you have a child in your stomach that is his, how does that make you feel? My business, your concern. Because I'm doing my job okay, for that person right you. behind you who is his girlfriend of six me, years. Excuse me, sir. Trifling. Off? Let's both go home. You want to walk No, off? there is no both. I made it very clear. You can keep her and you can keep that little that little baby that she got growing in her stomach. Little baby. baby. Both. I don't his want, baby. I don't want none. You're right. And both. how many other babies? How many other women does he um, have? Pregnant? I don't know. You, you don't should, know because you're sitting here then, bitch. You should be the one really concerned about it. And I'm so happy that I don't. And I'm so happy that I don't. And that's why you're hiring me. For this exact same reason. And that's why you're hiring me. For this exact same reason. No family. For this exact same reason. No family. No family. No family. I don't know this. Whatever the hell she is. Don't touch me. Harmony. No. Harmony. 
you too. What? I mean, what's up? No, no. What's it's only facing an opportunity. I told you. I told you it's nothing. It's I'm not, nothing. I'm not worried about you. Oh, I bet you're not worried about you. I'm not worried about you. So right. what? The one that's cheating on you. Uh, right. You're pregnant by a man that's Ashley cheating. He's cheating on, he's he's cheating on you. Before. Right. 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 If your child saw this, how do you think you would feel, Ashley? That she's immature and she's a child. How would you feel if your child knew she's that this is the way that she was brought into the world? Well, I don't by a know. cheating man. I don't know. I, I never had sex. It's never had sex. She probably swallowed my babies, but oh. I never had security. And then, again, this is the man that you want to have a baby with. This is the man that you're with. No, the same I, one who won that man that he got people fighting you. Right, so says a lot about you. Now. He can't even admit that he's Hey, guys, let's go. Let's Everybody go. out. Y'all are fighting on my property. Let's I want y'all gone. Let's go. Whatever. Let's I'm done. Let's I'm done. There's no baby. Permit. I'm done. Permit. It's over. No. It's over with. You no. made your decision. No, it's not over. Come on, guys. Let's go. It's not over, Harmony. No, it is. I'm going to call you. It is. I'm going to call don't you. Don't call me. Don't talk to me. Don't do anything. Screw you. You are a jerk. I'm going to call you. And you are, too. You see, obviously, where he stands. What do you want to do? You ready I'm to ready go? to go. All right, let's go. I'm ready to go. I don't have anything up. else to say. Where are you going? Give me the keys. If you don't want to drive up, I'll drive up in your Give me the keys. Give me the keys. I don't have the keys. I lost I just the keys. Put them in your pocket. Give me the keys. keys. And you're still over oh, here? Oh, you're mad? You're oh, still oh, over here. Oh. Yeah, I'm over here. So what's no, up? You're still oh. over here. Yeah, get your... Go get in the car. Jay, step back for a minute. Move step away. Back. Move away. <laughs> Harmony, relax. You better relax. be glad, bitch. You, I'll walk no, around you with you. Relax. I will walk you're around with you. You're be a mother. Serious. Remember that. You're a mother. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Is this really worth it to you? Holding a child in your stomach? Can you talk to somebody else? I'm gonna talk to someone who doesn't talk care. To someone else, I don't know you. I don't care, I don't know She's you whatever. either. Whatever. Uh, don't don't Listen, touch hey, me. Give me the keys. Dude, don't touch your hands me. off your girl, tie-dye man. What are you doing? Don't, don't touch me. Me. Give me the keys. Let's go. Let's go. Go ahead and keep her. Call me. Call me, honey. Leave me alone, Jay. Let's load up. going to regret losing me. He's going to regret this decision that he made to be with her because I am going to be the best woman that he's ever had. Coming up, but for now, Harmony Vance comes to cheaters with suspicions concerning her boyfriend's anger issues. Desperately needing answers to her queries, Harmony begs for help. There are times where we may get into it or it may be something small as I wanted a piece of gum and he didn't give it to me to where he would get so mad to where he wouldn't speak with me for a weekend, for a whole weekend. And at first, I didn't think anything of it, but after so long, I'm, I, it just started getting suspicious where it would seem Thursday, we're okay, and then come Friday, there's some reason to be mad, and then you go the whole weekend without speaking to me. So we go to, to the same church on Sundays. So Sundays, it's usually, you know, Sunday morning, I don't hear anything. Sunday, get to church. I'm there, I don't say anything, and then midway through service, I may get a message saying I look nice or, hey, how was my weekend? And he comes back and he, and he just starts talking to me like nothing happened, like we didn't just not talk the whole weekend. Jay Talley, age 24, a website moderator accused of modifying his relationship by uploading with another woman. Cheaters headquarters dispatches a unit to follow the suspect from his residence. Tally arrives at an apartment complex and enters one of the buildings. Tally emerges from the apartment with a young, unknown female. The two get into the suspect's car. I questioned him about a, a name in a text message that i seen. I, there's recently, I've seen the name Anthony pop up, and I know generally all of the people that he associates with. And Anthony is all through the call logs, all through mes messages. I haven't actually seen the messages, but there's this new name, Anthony. So when I questioned him about the name Anthony, he immediately, you know, made it into a big deal. We didn't speak. So it's really hard. I most of the time try to find my friends, see what they're doing to, to find things to do to keep myself occupied so I'm not thinking about it. Because literally, I sit at home if I don't have anything to do and I'm, and I'm going through my head you know, trying to figure out what went wrong. What did I do?